You're watching the Comcast Network. CN100, Chicago. Welcome to Lombard, everybody, for the CN100 Game of the Week. We are at Glenbard East High School for When Sides Collide. And we have the pleasure of bringing you the Bloom Trojans against the Evanston Wildcats. Welcome, everybody. I'm Jim Blaney along with Cameron Smith. This is a matchup worthy of a state championship game. Both of these teams at various times during the season have been ranked number one in the state of Illinois. Let's start off by talking about the Evanston Wildcats. They played last night. They had a weird game against New Trier. <laughs> they ended up winning it. Evanston only scored 16 points in the first half, but they figured out a way to get a victory. They can't play worse today. I would expect they're going to play a lot better. They played better yeah. in the second half. And I don't think they'll play any worse today. I think they'll actually play a lot better. Now, remember that win last night against Nutria? They finished with 49 points. So that's unlike an Evanston team that loves to push tempo. They start five guards, and I haven't seen that since the old Westinghouse days when Chris Head was the head coach, and we know what he did with those teams in winning a state championship. So Evanston has a formula that's proven, but they must win the turnover battle today if they want to win this ball game. The challenge when you play Bloom is – who do you try and stop? I mean, you talk about a balanced team, Cameron. One of the reasons why the Trojans were ranked number one at the start of the season because they easily have the best balance across their roster. Yeah, and they can transform a game easily into a dunk contest. Like, this is how athletic this team is, and I love watching them play because they do it from so many different angles, and they play as a cohesive unit. Dante Maddox leads this group, but they also have a guy named Christian Shoemate who has been a huge impact for this Blazing Trojan team. I'm excited to see them play on this matchup against Evanston. Evanston has three buckets. They've all been threes. Yeah, Jalen Gibson says, hey, we need some baskets. He had baskets. He has six points. Shoemate. Whoa. And Shoemate gets fouled. Christian Shoemate telling the Wildkids, hey, welcome to my mixtape. And a beautiful runner in the lane that fails to fall. Holden will take it the other way. Holden up the floor. What wow. a job to get that up and over the defender. Oh, it is. Isaiah Holden, have yourself a ball game, young man. We have had a 16-point swing. Evanston from seven down in the first quarter to nine up with two and a half to go here in the second. Um, you can buy your Devon Bell poster at the concession stand. Wow. Well, that's how Mark Kuru used to do it back in his down throw south right. days, right? That's what, I, that's what I think of. My goodness, Dante Maddox Jr. Drive down the lane. Nobody took Holden, and he made a couple of those last night. Missed that one. Fowles gets the bucket, and he'll go to the line and one. How about that, Isaiah Holden? Once again, it's like deja vu. How many times have we seen him get second chance points off of his own misses? That's a nice spin, and there's the end one. Couple of minutes left, Evanston with the ball. They're up by one. Peters, three-pointer. Wow. Oh, so clutch. Peters for three. Peters with 24, six three-pointers on the game. To view this Xfinity program in its entirety, visit CN100.TV for a list of airtimes or view this program anytime on demand by selecting Get Local and choosing Game of the Week. For Xfinity X1 customers, scroll over to Xfinity Services and select Get Local or simply say Get Local into your voice remote. 